Spot cleared. Detecting landmark. Rogue agent neutralized. Agent eliminated. Okay, we're approaching the catacombs landmark, which is supposed to be cool, I guess. Oh, well, at least it's actually underground. Seems like it's a parking garage, though. Cola. That's in Coca? Oh, what? Damn. It's a hard hitter. It's kind of weird that it has survived that. Let me move up so I can put this here. Ah, it's my turret malfunctioning again. Nice. I don't know what it is. If there's a specific reason that I'm doing wrong or that it's just glitched. Look, I designated target. Blow tear it up. I'm not healing, it's destroying my skill. Well, yeah, okay. I'm healing through the drone. Bye bye. Landmark has been cleared. Nice, what did he drop? Gloves. And then Richter and Kaiser back. Nice. Oh, okay. He's too high of a level for me, apparently. Let's take him. Engaging landmark. Sarah Camp. I think they're just hyena. I mean, what's. What's so high level about these guys? This one I can understand, she has a shocky stick. The other ones were just red ones. Huh. I thought she would be flanking. Got him. Turtle. He's busy. I think there's someone over here still. Yeah. I think this isn't gonna save you. Not when I have my MPX. And clear. I think you have a. I think I have a dark zone perk. Thank you. I think I have a dark zone perk which increases the XP or the loot you get from clearing landmarks. You can also choose for doing it for rogue gameplay or killing other agents or something. So that's pretty cool. So apparently there's a patrol right here. With yellow enemies. Interesting. Let's get him. Let's 
get the rusher first. Nice. Oh man. They have EMP grenades. Oh, where was that? Let's rush him. Or her, who knows. Don't want to discriminate based on their gender. I like to kill all genders, no worries. Okay. Oh, that wasn't a smart idea. Hold feet, hold feet, hold feet. Come on, turd. Kill him. This landmark here, the grave. Cool. Oh, Jesus, who's the? It's a medic. Shit, he's reviving. Bastard. Surround it. It's not good. It's not good. They're smarter than they sound. Look. Both. I don't want to flank this way, but this guy's in the way, okay. Okay, I think we're good for now. Good position, we're full health again. Let's get a get good position and clear this freaking landmark. Come on, nails. Bring it to me. Man, I love the MK17. So far I've seen it's the strongest rifle. In terms of damage. And there's some weird ass rifles, man. There used to be SMGs and assault rifles like... The lightweight M4. Is now called the LAR 15, something with sport or something, with the converted UC, what used to be an SMG. It's also on a, a rifle. AUG A360 is, is now a, uh, an assault rifle, which is nice. Yay, I'm leveling. Wondering how far you can level in the in the beta. I'm not sure what it, it will be in the actual game. Should be should be more than 30 at least. Guess we'll see. I think they did say it, but I uh, I can't remember everything, of course. But the Dark Zone is fun so far. Uh, I haven't really done any PvP, but I've done all the landmarks. I have done the conflict game mode, which is fun. I actually didn't play PvP in the Division 1, but I'm enjoying it now in Division 2. Especially now at the beginning, because nobody has these optimized gear sets and builds and stuff. And of course there's normalization now, so it's fair for everybody. Plus nobody really has good gear yet. I mean, I've seen some people getting purples, but most of all it's green and blues. Ok, 
Okay, we're nearing on the clock tower landmark. Got both of my skills back, that's nice. And I heard a door close. Hmm, suspicious. Okay, this is supposed to be a hard landmark. Wondering what what's so hard about it. And I'm pretty sure I just jinxed myself. Oh man, they're... Uh, what are they called? The outcasts? Nice. I think I kinda wanna die to them so I can get the, the info screen. Kill him first. Do that shit. Oh damn. Okay, I didn't get the choice. Nice. <laughs> I see why it's hard. Zero. Killed miserably against the outcast. Uh, on a hard landmark. It's the clock tower landmark, as you can see it's hard. But I get hit with an explosive bow. As well as something that shocked me. I'm not entirely sure what that something was. Can you? So we're gonna try this again. And I think if I'm a little bit careful when, when the, the bow guy is gonna shoot me. I don't think that's the bow guy. But I don't trust any of them. Man, that's a suicide bomber. Oh. What's that? I think that's an EMP or something. And it's the grey screen. Okay, for now... And these are pretty dangerous, the else, these outcasts. I think they're comparable to Rikers in terms of uh, lore. Is there escape prisoners? Well, I'm pretty sure because I made a video on it. Oh, oh just now I engaged the landmark. Let me finish him. Yeah, thank you. Nice. Well, it didn't hit the grenade, but at least it might have distracted them. Man, I don't trust this guy with the bow. I mean, besides him having an explosive bow, which is insanely strong. He's also a named enemy. Look at that man. He's firing like mortars. I wish I could have a bow. Well, we can have a crossbow of course. But he's, he's like permanently using a signature weapon. I guess there could be worse things. Look at him. There we go. Let's get up close. Stay in cover. Pretty awesome though, the the bow. I wanted to. Oh. Oh man, they have a heavy. <laughs> eh, what? Oh, 
they have flamethrowers. Unacceptable, they have females. <laughs> oh man, I almost, almost feel sorry for that guy. I like this faction, they're pretty cool. And they're actually somewhat challenging, and they have interesting archetypes. The guy with the bow, the guy with the flamethrower. I guess I'll go to the next landmark. 